Hello. How's it going, everybody? You can have to come up with a different line for the next one. Next yeah? challenge, yeah. The next challenge. Anyway, there's some ideas for me, and I'll use it <laughs> happily. Guys, welcome to day 26. Day 26. And you can see how excited Ryan is at the back here. <laughs> Because today's session is called Core Strength. Okay. But core Strength and Brain Strength. You need Brain Strength. Don't be fooled, guys. It's not just abs. Hey? Core is everything from the torso, that whole midsection, obliques, your lower back, your abs, your hamstrings, your glutes. Okay. All of those things make up the core. Okay. And a good core stability is essential okay so today we're really going to focus on that it's going to be a much lower intensity session than we're used to okay but don't be fooled you're going to be working hard cool i'm ready to work hard <laughs> okay you need a small ball or a pillow we're going to be using a pillow and then you need a resist oh that one doesn't show a resistance band okay you can either use a normal one like a, a long one and just tie it or if you've got a looped one, that's perfect as well. Okay, we'll be using the looped one. And then you also need a chair. Okay, so we'll be using like our Ottoman stool that we usually use. Okie dokie, your warm up, guys. It's not so much of like intense timing and stuff today. Okay, I'm going to play around with timing. So you just follow my lead. Okay, and we will get going. I want you to start those fitness devices. We are going to start with some walkouts as a warm-up so you're bending the knees hands are on the floor walking out you're going to pause there for a couple seconds tighten the core squeeze the glutes and then walk back okay we're going to join ryan in three two one let's go that's it so this is part of your warm-up okay and we're wanting to engage the, the whole body really and in this position we can really get everything engaged okay there we go. So in that workout, you're engaging the core. You can feel it activating. We're squeezing those glutes. There we go. For your next workout, I want you to add in a shoulder tap to each side. Okay, so we're going to walk all the way out. Shoulder tap one, two, and then walk back. If you need to go onto your knees for the shoulder tap, that is perfect. You drop the knees down, you do the shoulder tap, and then we push back up and walk back. There we go. That's it. Excellent. We're going to do one more like this. And after that, we're going to do another one and we're going to hold it there. Okay. There we go. So now come all the way back. There we go. We're going to do one more and then hold it there. Okay. Now we're going to stay there for 10 shoulder taps. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, stay there, bend the knees, pop them down on the floor. There we go. And we're going into your opposite arm and leg. There we go. I want you pulling in through that belly button. We're extending, holding it there, and then swapping over. Okay. I want you, nice straight leg, and try and squeeze that glute. Okay. That's it. There we go. So nice and gentle here. Okay, guys, today is going to be a no repeat session so we're going to flush through everything once some things involve left and a right side obviously we will do both sides okay but once the exercise is done it is done there we go how are those feeling right yeah i'm getting warm <laughs> don't know what i was thinking leaving this jacket on for there we go let's do two more that's it. Last one. There we go. Relax your feet. Just sit back into that prayer stretch. Let's just do a nice little release of the lower back. There we go. And when you're ready, let's just come up nice and slowly. Excellent. Okay, come up. Take your jersey off if you need Come to. up nice and slowly. <laughs> there we go. Okay, guys, you need your chair for this first block. Okay, you're going to grab your chair. We are going to do a chair plank. Okay. And we are tapping your feet side to side. Okay, so your elbows are bent and we are tapping side to side. Make sure that you are actually...
activating your core. If you struggle with the taps, just stay in that plank. Okay, we are going into that position and we are going in three, two, one. Let's go. Chair tap side to side, nice and gentle. Here we go. Good stuff. We're trying to activate that core now. Warm up your whole abdominal region. Okay. It should feel like your abs are activated. Are they? They activated. There we go. We're trying to keep your body nice and still. Okay. So really try and keep those hips still. We don't want you swaying from side to side. There we go. That's it. Keep going here. Just a little bit longer. Nice work. It's going to be a real full body, like full core session today. Two more. Last one. And recover. Nice work. Okay. Come up slowly. Are we good? Yeah. Okay. Hands on the chair. We're going into those glutes lifts. Okay. I want the leg lift nice and straight. You can see Ryan's in a nice straight line. Okay. His hips are directly underneath his feet. And we are lifting your left leg up and down behind you. Not swinging it. Control the lift. Okay. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. Nice and controlled. So we're wanting to get this boot and this hamstring strip working. Okay. That's it. Nice and controlled. Make sure you're pulling in belly button towards your spine. Your hamstrings and glutes are so important to the rest of your core area. There we go. How those feeling? I'm just going to smile. Just smile. There we go. Let's do two more. Last one. Excellent. Okay. I want you to go into your straight arm chair plank now. Okay legs behind you and we're going to do a very slow controlled chair climber there we go taking your knees straight in towards the same elbow okay we're not going diagonally we're going straight okay are you ready yes okay we are going in three two one let's go okay you might feel like it's a little bit i mean it is a slower session okay but i really want us to focus on the core Let's try and get that deep burn. Feel those muscles working. That's it. Good. And we're still just warming up, engaging that core, engaging those glutes and hamstrings, getting them all nice and warm. There we go. Excellent. Let's do four more. Three, two, one. Good. Sure. Core's burning. Shoulders are burning. Keep it. Okay, we're going into those right side group leg lifts now. Okay, so hands are on the chair again. Look at that form. Okay. So you want. And right side. We are lifting up and down. Remember, you try and don't let your back arch too much. Okay. We are going three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. Nice and controlled. There we go. Working that other glute now and that other hamstring. Ryan's on his right side now. That's it. Good work. Getting everything nicely engaged. How are they feeling? They're right. Yeah, they're working. Oh, we've got so much thunder here today. That's it. Let's do three more. Two. One. Good. And recover. Excellent. Okay, we're going to put your breather. Oh, thank you. Okay, we're going to grab your elastic bands for this next one. Okay, so don't need the chair. We are going to make use of the wall or the back of your chair if you've got a chair with a big back okay and i want the band around the front of your feet okay so people need to see your feet there we go that's it okay we're standing up nice and tall i want you engaging your core we're going to start with the left side 
How would you march in your left knee up towards you? There we go. Nice and controlled. We're working that side, your left core, okay, as well as those left hip flexors. Okay. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. Okay, so that whole left side tends to work. You feel it working? Good. Yes, ma'am. So it should be working. Like around here as well. Okay. <laughs> Pushing me over here. There we go. That's it. Does that feel okay? Yep. Good stuff. It's just, this is all stuff we don't normally do. Um, especially not on our own. <laughs> That's it. Last two. Good work. Relax the left. We're going to go straight across to the right side. Okay, exactly the same. Three, two, one. Let's go. Nice. There we go. And you want to make sure you're staying up nice and tall. Good work. I know we've thrown in a lot of core work throughout the throughout the 30 day, you know, throughout the challenge um, in between. But today is a proper dedicated core session, which you're either gonna love or you're gonna hate, <laughs> or love to hate. <laughs> no, that's mine. Love to hate. It. Love to hate it. That's it. You might feel like one side is stronger than the other. Last two. Good work. Now, I want you to turn sideways. You're going to have your hand on something. So we're going to use the wall. Otherwise, use your chair. We're going to bring that left leg now out to the side. Okay. So we're using the resistance of the band. Let's go. That's it. I want you to think of keeping that left leg nice and straight. Your range is not going to be big. Okay, it's going to be small because you've got resistance. Okay, that's it. Can you feel those moves working? Yes. <laughs> I chose the wrong session to do. <laughs> no, actually, I chose it. This is the right session for my bio to tell me what to do, actually. I thought you were going to shout now. Candace, get me out of here. I was about to say that. <laughs> What's that show? It was a show. Some, something, get me out of here or something. I think it was a British show. That's it. Last three, two, and one. Good job. Turn around. Other side. You're almost done with these. And then remember what I said. No repeat. So they're done. There we go. We might still work that muscle group later on, but no, this no, no. exercise is done. Okay. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. Oh. The second side is always harder. Because it's already done the stabilizing. You've already stood on it now for the other set. That's it. Okay. Make sure your knee stays straight. I don't want you bending your knee and the movement coming from the knee. The movement must come from the hips. Okay. From that glutes and those hips. There we go. Good stuff. That's it. Last three, two, and one. Good work. Let's take your band off. I want you to grab your pillow or your small ball as well as your chair. Okay, let's go pop the chair on your mat. You lie down on your back with both feet up on the chair. There we go. And the pillow between your knees. There we go. So I want the middle of your foot on your chair. Yeah. No, no, no. The middle of your foot. There we go. Well done. Oh, good oh, work, right? Good work, Okay. I want hands behind the back of your head. We're going to go into some gentle crunches with a pillow squeeze. Okay. So as you curl the head and shoulders up, I want you squeezing the pillow or your ball. So whichever one you're using. Okay. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. 
Good. Nice and controlled crunch. Think of the movement coming. Try not to use your lower back. There we go. And we are squeezing as you curl up. Nice. Good work. You're trying now to get those inner thighs working. They work quite well with your abdominal muscles. How are they feeling? Yeah, they're working. Good. That's it. Good stuff. Let's do three more. And two. And one. Excellent. Okay. Head down. Keep your arms at your side. Okay. And we are going to go into some bridging. Okay. I don't want you to squeeze your pillow or your ball. I just want you pushing those hips straight up and then coming down. There we go. Pushing straight up. So it's almost like you're pushing down through your feet. That's what's going to cause your hips to go up. Okay. We are working those hamstrings. Okay. Let's go. That's it. Good stuff. How are those hammies feeling? Yeah, okay. you know exactly how they're feeling. I do. We're going to add in that squeeze. So now we're going to push up. I want you squeezing that pillow and then coming down. There we go. Good. That's it, guys. Those hamstrings sometimes want to um, go into cramp. There we go. Next one, I want you holding it up there. We're pushing up, hold. I want you to squeeze 10 times. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's come down. Oh, my word. We're going to do that one more time, okay, with the 10 squeezes, okay? There we go. Let's go. We're pushing up. Let's hold it up there. Squeezing. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and let's come down. Oh, they will be. No, no. Now I know why she asked me if I'm playing hockey tonight after I've trained. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, are you training and going to play hockey tonight? <laughs> okay, guys, we are lying on your side now. Okay. Doesn't matter. No change. Doesn't matter which side, you decide, okay? We're gonna stay on that side for two exercises and then roll over to the other side, okay? I want you to relax your head, so put your arm, bend your arm and lie down, there we go. Both legs completely straight. We are lifting your top leg up and down, okay? Let's go in three, two, one, let's go. That's it. work I'm just watching your form. Form, yeah. yes isn't it just picturesque it is I'm trying to spot I can see you shaking with the previous exercise so I was looking to see if you were shaking yet that's it guys Good work. Next one. Hold it up there. Hold it there now. There we go. Hold it there for 10. Oh, no. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and relax. Oh. I'm tapping out. I'm tapping out. I'm tapping out. Okay. Straighten. Keep both legs straight. I want your head relaxed this time. So head down. And we are lifting both legs up together okay so try not to swing them it's more of a lift okay we're working those top obliques okay yes there okay it can be a very small lift off the floor okay we are going in three two one let's go that's it good stuff it's going to be interesting to see if anybody's stuck after the session There we go. A little bit different to what we're used to. 
a little bit different to what Ryan likes. <laughs> that sense. It's all for the greater good of mankind. Ah, uh, well, you know. Good stuff, guys. Next one, hold it up there. Lift and hold. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and recover. Nice work. Okay, Ryan, before you roll over, I want you to go onto your hands and knees. And we're going to do a plank in and out. Okay, so remember this one. Your knees are slightly off the floor. Okay, and then we're going to step your feet out behind you. And then step them back in again. Okay, these are called your plank in and out. Okay. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> we are going in three, two, one, let's go. That's it. Woo. I think this is the appropriate weather for the way Ryan's feeling right now. <laughs> That's it. And we just gently, his knees are off the floor. Yours should be too. And we are just stepping those knees in and out. Okay. Working into that core. That's it, guys. Almost there. We're just giving those hips a break before we roll over to the other side. There we go. We're going to do two more. Last one. Good, and relax. Nice. Okay, we're going to roll over now to the other side. You know what's coming. <laughs> yeah, hello, Sam. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okie dokie. On your roll over to the other side. Both legs straight. Relax your head. We're lifting your top leg up and down. Three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. Nice. I'm going to a happy place. <laughs> he would never normally do these things, so it's really good for him. <laughs> no one feels sorry for you anyway. <laughs> That's it. Keep going. Nice work, everybody. I know things are burning, things that you didn't know you had. We're going to hold it up there. Let's go. Hold it there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bring it down. There we go. Relax your head on the floor now. Both legs together, and we are lifting both legs up and down together. Let's go. Good. Nice work. Making sure that you get a full core workout here today. A bit of everything. And at least you don't have to worry about me going just now saying, okay, we're going to start back at the top. <laughs> there we go. Keep going, gently lifting up and down. Your next one, we're holding it up there. Lift and hold. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and recover. <laughs> okay, where are you going? <laughs> we're going to lie on your backs. Okay, let's go. Lying on your back. Good job. Okay, so now we've got to listen to these prompts carefully. I want your right leg to stay bent. You're going to straighten your left leg out on the floor. You're pulling your toes back towards you on the left leg. And be lifting your left leg up and down to the level of your bent leg. Okay? I want you to engage that core. Okay? We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. That's it. Nice and controlled. Okay. It feels like the leg is working. It is. Okay. But so is the hip flexor and so are those lower tummy muscles on that side. 
plus you might feel your hamstring stretching each time you lift your leg. That's it. Good stuff. Keep that knee locked straight. Let's keep those correct muscles working. That's it. Two more. Last one. Good. Now I want you to place your left ankle up on your right knee. Hands are down to the side. No, no, no. We're going into your single leg bridge. Pushing up through that right foot and down. Okay, there we go. We're going three, two, one. Let's go. And that left leg that's up, bring the knee, turn the knee so that it's kind of facing towards you versus out to the side. Okay, we want your hips to stay in a good alignment. There we go. Pushing through that whole right foot. Okay, not just your heel, not just your toes. Think of pushing up through that whole foot. There we go. Working just that right side. Excellent. Last one. Good. Come down. Keep that leg up. I want hands behind the back of your head. We are going to crunch up and across, taking your right elbow towards that left knee. Okay, in three, two, one, let's go. Okay, so here, guys, we're getting that rotation from your upper body. Okay, think of sliding that right rib cage across your body towards your left knee. There we go. That's it. Good stuff. Nice work. Guys, we're so close. We have flowing through the session. We are so close to the end. That's it. Make sure you're breathing. Good stuff. Last one. Good and relax. Good stuff. Okay, Ryan, we're going into a dead bug first. Okay, so both legs are up to 90 degrees. Arms are up as well. There we go. So it's like an opposite arm and leg, but on your back. If you struggle with extending the leg out, you're going to do a toe tap. Okay. So exactly the same, but you're just shortening the lever and tapping down on the floor. Okay. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. Okay. Here, make sure you are pressing your lower back into the floor. Okay. By doing that, you are automatically engaging those core muscles. That's it. Good stuff. There we go. Keep breathing now. You should be able to feel the whole front side of the abdominals doing some work from right up at the top all the way down. We've got very little commentary coming from the back. <laughs> Take note. Last two. Take note. <laughs> Last one. Gently hug both knees into your chest. Good stuff. Just hold it there. Nice. Okie dokie. Both feet on the floor. We're going to straighten your right leg out this time. We're going into those leg raises on your right hand side. Make sure you're pulling your toes up towards you. Three, two, one. Let's go. So we're doing that, those three exercises now on the other side. That's it. Your knees and rocking. Keep it nice and straight. There we go. <laughs> that's it. I know it's just tight hands, but that's it. And you really want to focus on keeping that whole midsection so your torso really is still and controlled during these leg raises. That's it. Almost there. Let's do two more. Last one. Excellent. You're going to put your right ankle now up on your left knee. We're going into your single leg bridging. Foot flat on the left. 
There we go. Pushing straight up. Let's go. That's it, guys. Pushing straight up and down. So you're just pausing up at the top for a couple seconds and down. Pushing through the whole left foot. Nice. Good work, guys. Day 26, almost in the bag. That's it. Good work. Almost there. Let's do two more. Good stuff. Last one. Excellent. Come down. Hands behind the back of your head. We're taking that left elbow, bringing it up and across towards your right knee. Let's go. Nice. This is how I would instruct the class at work in our practice. So it feels quite nice, actually. It's almost feeling super familiar. <laughs> That's it. Good work. There we go. Almost there. I want you to do three more. Two. Last one. Excellent. I want you now straighten both legs out on the floor. Arms are up above your chest. We're going into roll-ups and roll-downs. Okay. Tucking the chin in, curling all the way up. Reaching towards your toes. That's it. Okay, I want you to reach forward so you'll feel a stretch. Tuck the chin in as well. And then sit up nice and tall and then roll down slowly. Here we go. Remember, the slower you roll down, the longer we work those abdominal muscles for. There we go. Right in that stretch now. No, no, no. Reach forward. Tuck your chin in during the stretch. There we go. Then sit up nice and tall. There we go. And then roll down slowly. Nice. If you can't get all the way up, I want you to bend your knees. Okay? And arms are up, and then you're just going to kind of come halfway, reaching your arms towards your knees. Okay? That's it. Sitting up nice and tall, rolling down slowly, working that core. Excellent. We're going to do two more here. Excellent. Last one. That's it. Nice and tall. Rolling down for the last time. And let's hug both those knees into your chest. Works. I'm happy. I'm happy. <laughs> oh, good. And recover. We beat the time, eh? Sure. Very good. Well done, Very everybody. Good. Something totally well different. Um, but yeah, that whole core worked. Everything had a core um, uh, focus, to focus to it. That's exactly the word I was looking for. Um, and yeah, something different. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah. Well done, everybody. I'm pretty sure the majority of you are on the same page as me. Maybe not. But that was good. Needed, got to do it. Good luck to my hockey match tonight. <laughs> <laughs> day 26 done, guys. We'll see you on Monday for day 29. See you soon.